In this video, I'll be walking you through a beginner's guide to Freepik. To get started, the first step is to visit freepik.com. Once you arrive, you'll see a homepage similar to this one. We're going to take a quick look at what Freepik offers and give you an overview of its features. Freepik is one of the standout all-in-one AI platforms. At its core, Freepik is a collection of AI-powered creative tools covering everything from image and video generation to much more. On the image side, you'll find a prompt bar and multiple AI models to choose from, including Mystic, Freepik's proprietary model. That alone sets it apart from many competitors. Additionally, Google's Imagine 3 is available, a model known for its impressive prompt accuracy. You can also use Flux, which allows for easy model training. If you've primarily been using Midjourney and want to branch out, Freepik is a great option to explore. As you scroll down the main page, you'll notice a variety of designs and templates created by other users. This gives you a good idea of what's possible with Freepik. If you find something that catches your eye, you can click on the Use This Prompt button. This will open Freepik's creation tool, allowing you to generate an image based on that specific prompt. Now, let's take a look at the top menu. Under Tools, you'll find several features, including an image generator, a mock-up generator, a design editor, a video generator, and even a voice generator. These tools offer a wide range of creative possibilities. For example, the image generator allows you to create AI-powered visuals, while the voice generator lets you add AI-generated voiceovers that sync with your videos. There's also an option to remove backgrounds, create alternate versions of images, enhance image quality with upscaling, and expand images beyond their original borders. Additionally, Freepik provides a built-in photo editor for quick adjustments. Moving on to the Images section, you'll see categories like vectors, photos, and AI-generated images. Under Vectors, Freepik offers illustrations, textures, patterns, and even clip art. The Photos tab includes categories such as business, nature, food, sports, and more. If you're looking for AI-generated images, Freepik has thousands of them ready to explore. Now, let's focus on Freepik's AI Image Generator. Here, you can type a prompt to describe the image you want to create. The platform offers different AI models, including Mystic, Flux, and Classic, each with unique styles and levels of realism. You can also choose from different aspect ratios, styles, and effects to fine-tune your image. To put these models to the test, I use the same prompt across different AI systems. A street photograph of a blonde woman chasing after butterflies in an empty street with graffitis on the walls of buildings. As you can see, Flux did well, capturing details like the bright butterflies and the stylistic graffitis. Mystic 2.5 demonstrated strong prompt adherence, accurately rendering the woman's clothes, the sidewalk, and the houses. Meanwhile, Imogen 3 also produced a well-matched output, capturing every requested detail. One interesting distinction between Mystic 2.5 and Imogen 3 is how they handle color saturation and overall tone. However, Freepik offers built-in tools to tweak brightness, contrast, highlights, shadows, and even color adjustments, essentially a mini version of Adobe Lightroom within the platform. Once your image is generated, you can edit or modify it, publish it, or use it as inspiration for another creation. There's even an option to turn your AI-generated image into a video. One of Freepik's newest and most exciting features is its integration with Magnific, a creative upscaler that enhances AI-generated images. If you've wanted to try Magnific, you can now do so directly within Freepik. It offers different presets like subtle, vivid, and wild, along with control over styles such as film photography. Running an upscale through Magnific adds extra texture and detail, making images pop. However, if cranking up creativity causes distortions, like an unwanted extra face in an image, Freepik has a retouch tool that lets you easily remove unwanted elements. Another valuable feature is out painting, which allows you to extend images while maintaining quality. Whether you need to shift from a 4x3 to a 21 by 9 aspect ratio or any other format, Freepik makes it seamless. If the generated expansion isn't quite right, you can adjust it with additional prompts or edit it manually. In addition to its various AI models, Freepik offers a selection of style presets. For example, running the same prompt through the Comic preset 
delivers dynamic, action-packed results, while surrealist fashion completely transforms the aesthetic, resembling vintage European sci-fi movie posters. Beyond preset styles, you can also train your own custom models on Freepik. By uploading reference images, you can create a personalized style or generate characters unique to your brand or projects. I even trained a model on my own likeness, allowing me to generate AI images of myself in various scenarios. Switching over to video generation, Freepik provides access to major AI video models, including Runway, Luma Dream Machine, Minimax, and more. It even includes lesser-known options like Hunan and Pixiverse, plus specialized tools like Minimax's live illustrations and reference-based video generation. Freepik also provides access to pro-tier features from select models. For example, running Sing 1.6, pro at 10 seconds, would usually require a paid subscription, but Freepik allows users to try it within the platform. Additionally, Freepik offers features like automatic sound effect generation for videos. After creating an AI video, you can apply sound effects based on text prompts, adding an extra layer of immersion. Another standout tool is built-in lip syncing, where you can either upload custom audio or select from AI-generated voice options. The results aren't perfect, but they're a solid starting point. Beyond AI-powered image and video tools, Freepik includes a suite of design resources, covering everything from print-ready templates to vector graphics. Whether you need business cards, posters, or logos, Freepik has a dedicated section for professional design assets. Let's check out the Icons section. Freepik allows users to create custom icons, which is useful for branding and design projects. Under Videos, you'll find AI-generated video content in different themes, such as travel, nature, business, and sports. For those needing templates, Freepik provides design tools for making logos, flyers, resumes, posters, business cards, and banners. In the PSD section, you'll find templates for social media posts, greeting cards, invitations, and posters. There's also a mock-up section, which allows you to create visuals for t-shirts, book covers, and other products. If you want to start from scratch, you can select Create from Scratch to access a variety of design options. The editing interface includes text customization, different fonts, and layer adjustments, making it easy to personalize your designs. Freepik even offers additional resources like presentation templates, 3D illustrations, fonts, and stock videos in 4K and full HD. As the name suggests, Freepik offers a free plan that includes up to 20 AI-generated images per day and two upscales. Paid plans start at $9 per month, with the highest tier plan costing $39 per month, though annual subscriptions currently come at a 40% discount. That means the most expensive plan is just $24.50 per month, which is actually cheaper than Midjourney's mid-tier plan. If you haven't explored Freepik in a while, it's worth checking out. Even if you're just curious, you can start by generating some images for free. I'd love to hear your thoughts. What do you think of Freepik? And what features would you like to see added? Industry professionals do pay attention to feedback, so drop your suggestions in the comments. Overall, Freepik stands out as a versatile AI-powered platform for image and video creation. If you're looking for an all-in-one tool, this is definitely worth exploring. Let me know what you think in the comments. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more helpful guides.